Welcome to our video on the best vitamins to stop calcium plaque in your arteries and heart. Maintaining a healthy cardiovascular system is crucial for overall well-being, and one important aspect of heart health is preventing the buildup of calcium plaque in the arteries. Calcium plaque can restrict blood flow, increase the risk of heart disease, and potentially lead to heart attacks or strokes. While a balanced diet and a healthy lifestyle are key components of cardiovascular health, certain vitamins can also play a significant role in preventing and reducing the accumulation of calcium plaque in the arteries. In this video, we will explore the top vitamins that have been studied for their potential in stopping the formation of calcium plaque and supporting a healthy heart. We will delve into the science behind how these vitamins work and how they can be incorporated into your daily routine. Before we begin, make sure to like this video and subscribe to our channel so you won't miss any of our future videos on health and wellness. We're here to provide you with valuable insights to support your well-being. Now if you're ready to learn about the best vitamins to stop calcium plaque in your arteries and heart, let's dive right in. At number 7, Vitamin K2. Vitamin K2 is a lesser known but vital nutrient when it comes to maintaining cardiovascular health. It works in synergy with other nutrients such as vitamin D and calcium to ensure proper calcium metabolism in the body. Research suggests that vitamin K2 plays a significant role in preventing the accumulation of calcium in the arteries and redirecting it towards the bones, where it is essential for maintaining bone density. A study published in the Journal of Nutrition found that individuals with higher vitamin K2 intake had a lower risk of coronary artery calcification, a marker of calcium plaque formation in the arteries. Another study published in Atherosclerosis, Thrombosis, and Vascular Biology demonstrated that increased vitamin K2 intake was associated with a reduced risk of cardiovascular events. The mechanism behind vitamin K2's protective effect lies in its ability to activate proteins known as matrix GLA proteins, MGP, which help prevent calcium from depositing in the arterial walls. By promoting proper calcium distribution, vitamin K2 contributes to the maintenance of arterial health and reduces the risk of calcium plaque formation. Food sources of vitamin K2 include fermented foods like natto, certain cheeses, and organ meats, However, obtaining adequate amounts of vitamin K2 solely through diet can be challenging, so supplementation may be necessary for some individuals. It's important to note that vitamin K2 supplementation should be done under the guidance of a healthcare professional, especially if you are taking certain medications or have underlying medical conditions. Number 6. Vitamin D. Vitamin D, often referred to as the sunshine vitamin, plays a crucial role in calcium homeostasis and overall health. It assists in the absorption and utilization of calcium, which is essential for maintaining strong bones and teeth. When it comes to cardiovascular health, vitamin D's role extends beyond calcium regulation. Research has shown that vitamin D deficiency is associated with an increased risk of cardiovascular diseases, including the development of calcium plaque in the arteries. A study published in the Journal of the American College of Cardiology found that individuals with low vitamin D levels had a higher prevalence of coronary artery calcification, indicating an increased risk of calcium plaque formation. Vitamin D also possesses anti-inflammatory properties, which are beneficial for heart health. Chronic inflammation within the arteries can contribute to the development and progression of atherosclerosis, a condition characterized by the buildup of plaque in the arterial walls. By reducing inflammation, vitamin D can help maintain the integrity of the blood vessels and support optimal cardiovascular function. While the primary source of vitamin D is sunlight exposure, it can also be obtained through certain foods such as fatty fish, for example salmon mackerel, fortified dairy products, and egg yolks. However, it can be challenging to meet the recommended daily intake of vitamin D through diet alone, especially for individuals living in regions with limited sun exposure. Supplementation may be necessary to achieve adequate vitamin D levels, particularly in individuals who have limited sun exposure or are at higher risk of deficiency. 
It's important to consult with a healthcare professional to determine the appropriate dosage based on your specific circumstances and to monitor your vitamin D levels regularly. Number five, vitamin C. Vitamin C, also known as ascorbic acid, is renowned for its immune boosting properties. However, its benefits extend beyond immune support. Vitamin C plays a crucial role in cardiovascular health and may help prevent the formation of calcium plaque in the arteries. One of the key roles of vitamin C is its potent antioxidant activity. It helps neutralize harmful free radicals that can damage the arterial walls and promote inflammation. Oxidative stress and inflammation are known contributors to the development of atherosclerosis and the accumulation of calcium plaque in the arteries. By reducing oxidative stress and inflammation, vitamin C helps protect the arterial walls and supports overall heart health. Another important function of vitamin C is its involvement in collagen synthesis. Collagen is a structural protein that provides strength and elasticity to the arterial walls. It helps maintain the integrity of the blood vessels and prevents the formation of weak spots that can lead to calcium plaque buildup. Adequate levels of vitamin C are essential for optimal collagen production, ensuring the arterial walls remain strong and flexible. Several studies have investigated the association between vitamin C intake and cardiovascular health. A study published in the journal Nutrients found that higher vitamin C intake was associated with a reduced risk of cardiovascular disease and mortality. Another study published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition reported that higher vitamin C levels were associated with a lower prevalence of subclinical atherosclerosis. To incorporate more vitamin C into your diet, focus on consuming fruits and vegetables that are rich in this nutrient. Citrus fruits like oranges, grapefruits, and lemons are excellent sources of vitamin C. Other options include strawberries, kiwis, bell peppers, broccoli, and leafy greens. By including a variety of these vitamin C-rich foods in your diet, you can support your arterial health and reduce the risk of calcium plaque formation. While a healthy diet is the primary source of vitamin C, supplementation may be beneficial for individuals with limited access to fresh produce or those who have difficulty meeting their daily requirements. It's important to consult with a healthcare professional to determine the appropriate dosage and ensure it aligns with your specific needs and overall health status. At number four, vitamin E. Vitamin E is a fat-soluble vitamin that possesses strong antioxidant properties. It plays a critical role in protecting the body against oxidative stress and is particularly known for its ability to prevent the oxidation of LDL, low-density lipoprotein, cholesterol. This is significant because the oxidation of LDL cholesterol is a crucial step in the development of atherosclerosis and the formation of calcium plaque in the arteries. When LDL cholesterol is oxidized, it becomes more susceptible to being trapped in the arterial walls, leading to the initiation and progression of atherosclerosis. This process involves the infiltration of immune cells and the deposition of calcium and other substances, eventually forming plaque. By inhibiting the oxidation of LDL cholesterol, vitamin E helps maintain the health and integrity of the arteries, reducing the risk of plaque formation. Numerous studies have examined the potential cardiovascular benefits of vitamin E. A meta-analysis published in the Journal of the American College of Cardiology analyzed data from 14 clinical trials and found that vitamin E supplementation was associated with a modest reduction in the risk of coronary heart disease. Another study published in the Journal of Nutrition reported that higher dietary intake of vitamin E was associated with a lower risk of developing peripheral artery disease. It's worth noting that while studies have shown promising results regarding vitamin E's role in cardiovascular health, the evidence is not entirely consistent. Some trials have failed to demonstrate significant benefits and there are ongoing debates about the optimal dosage and form of vitamin E supplementation. Further research is needed to fully understand the potential cardiovascular effects of vitamin E. To incorporate more vitamin E into your diet, focus on consuming foods rich in this nutrient. Good dietary sources of vitamin E include nuts, seeds, vegetable oils, 
such as sunflower, safflower, and wheat germ oil, spinach, and other leafy greens. Incorporating these foods into your meals and snacks can help increase your vitamin E intake and support arterial health. While vitamin E supplementation is available, it's important to exercise caution and consult with a healthcare professional before starting any supplementation regimen. High doses of vitamin E may have adverse effects and interact with certain medications. A healthcare professional can provide guidance on the appropriate dosage and help determine if supplementation is necessary for your specific circumstances. At number three, vitamin B6. Vitamin B6, also known as pyridoxine, is a water-soluble vitamin that plays a crucial role in various metabolic processes in the body. One of its important functions is the regulation of homocysteine, an amino acid that is produced during the breakdown of proteins. Elevated levels of homocysteine in the blood have been linked to an increased risk of cardiovascular disease, including the development of calcium plaques in the arteries. High homocysteine levels can promote inflammation, oxidative stress, and damage to the arterial walls, facilitating the deposition of calcium and other substances that contribute to plaque formation. Vitamin B6 is involved in the metabolism of homocysteine, converting it into other beneficial compounds. By ensuring that homocysteine is properly metabolized, vitamin B6 helps maintain healthy levels of this amino acid, reducing the risk of cardiovascular problems, including the formation of calcium plaques in the arteries. Several studies have investigated the relationship between vitamin B6 and cardiovascular health. A meta-analysis published in the Journal of the American Heart Association analyzed data from 10 cohort studies and found that higher vitamin B6 intake was associated with a reduced risk of coronary artery disease. Another study published in the European Journal of Clinical Nutrition reported that low levels of vitamin B6 were associated with an increased risk of cardiovascular disease. To incorporate more vitamin B6 into your diet, focus on consuming foods that are rich in this nutrient. Good dietary sources of vitamin B6 include poultry, fish, beef liver, chickpeas, bananas, and fortified cereals. By including these foods in your meals, you can ensure an adequate intake of vitamin B6 and support cardiovascular health. While it's important to maintain sufficient vitamin B6 levels, it's worth noting that excessive intake through supplementation may have adverse effects. It's generally recommended to obtain nutrients from whole foods rather than relying solely on supplements. At number two, magnesium. While magnesium is not classified as a vitamin, it is an essential mineral that plays a crucial role in various physiological processes in the body. One of its important functions is its involvement in calcium regulation. Magnesium helps maintain the balance between calcium and magnesium in the body, ensuring that calcium is properly utilized and preventing its excessive buildup in the arteries. Adequate levels of magnesium are essential for optimal cardiovascular health, as they help support proper muscle and vascular function. Several studies have highlighted the importance of magnesium in preventing cardiovascular disease and reducing the risk of calcium plaque formation in the arteries. A meta-analysis published in the journal Atherosclerosis found that higher magnesium intake was associated with a lower risk of ischemic heart disease. Another study published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition reported that higher dietary magnesium intake was associated with a decreased risk of cardiovascular disease. In addition to its role in calcium regulation, magnesium also helps relax the smooth muscles and blood vessels, promoting vasodilation and improving blood flow. It has anti-inflammatory properties and can help reduce oxidative stress, both of which contribute to the prevention of arterial calcification and the development of cardiovascular disease. To ensure sufficient magnesium intake, it is advisable to include magnesium-rich foods in your diet. Good dietary sources of magnesium include leafy green vegetables, nuts and seeds, legumes, whole grains, and some types of fish. By incorporating these foods into your meals, you can support your cardiovascular health and help prevent calcium plaque formation in the arteries. While obtaining magnesium from food sources is ideal, some individuals may require magnesium supplementation under the guidance of a healthcare professional. 
It's important to note that excessive magnesium supplementation can have adverse effects, especially for individuals with certain health conditions or taking certain medications. Therefore, it is recommended to consult with a healthcare professional to determine the appropriate dosage and to ensure it aligns with your specific needs. Last but not least is Number 1. Coenzyme Q10, CoQ10 Coenzyme Q10, CoQ10, is a naturally occurring compound that plays a crucial role in cellular energy production. It is found in every cell of the body, including the cells of the heart, where it helps generate energy for proper heart function. In addition to its role in energy production, CoQ10 is a potent antioxidant that helps neutralize harmful free radicals and reduce oxidative stress. Oxidative stress and inflammation are known contributors to the development and progression of cardiovascular diseases, including the formation of plaque in the arteries. Studies have shown the potential benefits of CoQ10 supplementation in improving arterial function and reducing the risk of plaque formation. A systematic review and meta-analysis published in the journal Atherosclerosis found that CoQ10 supplementation was associated with improvements in endothelial function, which is essential for maintaining healthy blood vessels. Another study published in the International Journal of Cardiology reported that CoQ10 supplementation improved arterial stiffness in patients with coronary artery disease. Furthermore, CoQ10 has been found to have anti-inflammatory properties, which can help reduce inflammation in the arterial walls and prevent the progression of atherosclerosis. Chronic inflammation is a significant risk factor for cardiovascular diseases, and by reducing inflammation, CoQ10 may help protect against plaque formation. It's important to note that while CoQ10 is naturally produced in the body, its levels may decline with age in certain health conditions. Therefore, supplementation with CoQ10 may be beneficial, especially for individuals with cardiovascular risk factors or deficiencies in CoQ10 production. While CoQ10 can be obtained through dietary sources such as organ meats, fish, and whole grains, it may be challenging to obtain sufficient amounts solely from food. Therefore, supplementation with CoQ10 capsules or soft gels may be a convenient and effective way to ensure adequate intake. However, as with any supplement, it is important to consult with a healthcare professional before starting CoQ10 supplementation. They can assess your specific needs, determine the appropriate dosage, and ensure it is safe and compatible with any existing medical conditions or medications. And there you have it. The best vitamins that have shown potential in stopping calcium plaque in your arteries and promoting a healthy heart. By incorporating these vitamins into your daily routine through a balanced diet, and if necessary supplementation, you can support your cardiovascular health and reduce the risk of calcium plaque formation. Remember to consult with your healthcare professional before making any significant changes to your diet or starting new supplements, especially if you have pre-existing medical conditions or are taking medications. Taking proactive steps to maintain a healthy heart is essential for long-term well-being. Along with a nutrient-rich diet, don't forget to engage in regular physical activity, manage stress levels, and maintain a healthy lifestyle overall. If you found this information valuable, don't forget to like this video and share it with others who might benefit. Subscribe to our channel and hit the notification bell to stay updated on our future videos where we continue to provide you with valuable insights to support your well-being. Thank you for joining us on this journey to learn about the best vitamins to stop calcium plaque in your arteries and promote a healthier heart. Stay curious, stay proactive about your health, and we'll see you in the next video.